Hi everyone, I'm Belina. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back if you're returning, and thank you. Okay, I'm a little late to uh, my video. Uh, busy week last week, and a couple of doctor's appointments, but I mean, I'm doing fine, just checkups. Uh, but, yeah, it's been busy. But I wanted to talk about, I finally, Saturday night, I got to see uh, uh, Taylor Swift's uh, documentary, Miss Americana. And, of course, I'm a very big fan of Taylor Swift. And I recommend this to any Taylor Swift fan. It's a must-see. And I have to say, there were parts that... I enjoyed it overall. I did. There were some parts that angered me. Not at Taylor. But there, you're going to have flashbacks, okay? Okay, we do get the, the nice things of seeing her writing songs. Um... That type of thing. But, of course, the Kanye West that came up. And, you know, as long as that's been, I cannot watch that without... I don't know. I wish Kanye the best. I, I know he proclaims to be a different person now, and I hope he really is. But that scene is still so hard to watch where she's on stage and, you know, what happens when he interrupts her. And here's the sad thing. When they were booing him, she thought they were booing her. That's really sad. And you see some clips. Um, you see some clips of uh, other things that people have said about her. Yeah, it's going to anger you a little bit, you know, if you're a fan. And, but you've got the awesomeness in it, too, of her finally just becoming who she is. Being herself. Because she was basically told to go by certain rules. Be a good girl. Don't say anything. And there's a lot of, of emotion in it. You're, I think you're re really going to like it if you haven't seen it yet. Um, between her and her mom. And there's an argu argument sort of between her and her dad. But, okay, I can understand him as a father being concerned for her. But I understand she had to be her. Taylor has actually gone through a lot, and she's very relatable. I've always felt that, even, you know, with her songs. I've said that I don't know how many times. But this documentary proves it. And on a lighter note, if you if you like seeing her cats, you're going to see a few shots of her cats. I, I love those cats. <laughs> They're adorable. But, yeah, um, she, had, she had to learn to basically start being who she was. And I think it's great. I, do, I think it's awesome. So, yes, I, I definitely recommend it. I did enjoy it. Like I said, those things are going to be there because it's it, this is raw. You know, we're, this is pretty raw, this, this documentary is. Uh, we're seeing Taylor be vulnerable. Uh, and, you know, she's, and she's being herself, okay? Uh, but, yes, very enjoyable. And not only would I recommend that of course, if you're a fan, you're probably going to watch it. I, I don't have Netflix. I would have watched it sooner. Um, I'm one of those unfortunate people who doesn't have Netflix, so I had to go to a friend's house to watch it. Um, I could pay for the subscription, yes, but I don't have a computer. I, if there's a way to watch it on the phone, I don't know about it. Let me know. I don't think there is. But anyway, um, I did want to see it. it it's great. Uh, it, it just opens... If you're not a fan... It's a must-see for fans, but even if you're not a fan, if you're one of these people, I hate Taylor Swift, and I've never understood the hate. I really, I haven't. You need to watch this. I mean, you can spare that much time. You need to watch it. And I'm not asking you to become a super fan, but I'm just, I, I realize we can't all like the same people. But maybe you will understand Taylor somewhat better after watching this. Just give it a chance. A lot of things are talked about, you know, the uh, the assault, um, the DJ, all that. I don't want to spoil everything, but yeah, like I said, it's raw. But, you know, great documentary. Great. Absolutely great. Uh, so, yeah, give it a chance. And, you know, we love you, Taylor. Um, I hope she knows her fans are always, you know, going to have her back. So, but yeah, she's... She's really grown. She really has. So, 
I'm going to go now, and thank you so much for watching. Uh, give me a like if you enjoyed this. Uh, comment, you know, what you thought about the documentary. Uh, subscribe, I would love that. So I'm going to go for now, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.